Hey, um, seems like it's been about a million years since I've uh, done a video. Uh, I'm doing a lot of renovations. Uh, not that they're not fun, they're just uh, different. Uh, a little bit of work, uh, physical work. See my thumb. Uh, working uh, in Zurich, Switzerland, which has been fun just outside Zurich. Uh, and it is a beautiful city. Yeah, we went uh, yesterday, I rode my motorcycle over yesterday, which is, I uh, tend here to uh, avoid autobahns, um, and it's, uh, it's just one of the things, you know, I, I don't like free riding that much anyway, even in America, unless you have a long distance to go, but Zurich is so oh, an hour and 15, unless you're on the motorcycle, and it's two hours and 30, or 2.45, and two little villages, and it's, it's just a... Uh, uh, different than anything I've ever done in my life. Uh, when I first got here, I didn't realize how, you know, you have this romantic vision of, oh my God, riding a motorcycle through Europe, how much fun would that be? And then you get into uh, 180 degree hairpin turns uh, while going up a significant elevation, while looking forward to go to the next hairpin turn uh, on a bike that's been lowered. Uh, my physical stature was real. I was really appreciative of when I got the bike and it was lowered uh, because uh, I can straddle it. I don't need training wheels on it. Yeah, and uh, but it, it uh, the foot pads drag from time to time, so it startles you. Even, but uh, overall, uh, one of my neighbors came over the other day and she said, "Do you like having your bike here?" I said, "Everything changes when you get on a motorcycle." And basically, it's true. It doesn't matter what kind of a day you're having. Uh, when you got on a bike, uh, it takes all of your concentration. You usually do things that you don't normally do. Like if we go to Zurich, Hortiga area, I usually take the car and go like hell on the Autobahn. And uh, I realized uh, yesterday on the way there that I can see two different lakes, the Lake of Zurich and the Wallensee, from one vantage point on the way there. And it's just you're so damn high up. And you've got to dress for it because it gets cool and cold. And, uh, and then it gets warm, uh, not hot, not like Texas. And Nicole and I were out on the bike um, in Texas a few years ago and we got caught in a rainstorm, and she started laughing. She said, now this is where you own a motorcycle, is when it's cold, when it's, even when it's raining, it's not cold. And that's basically a true statement, but uh, enjoying the bike here. Brought it over from Texas, uh, going to get it certified here. It still has Texas plates, which catches a little bit of attention. Uh, I asked some guy the other day uh, if I was anywhere near Kentucky after he asked me about the Texas plates, and uh, he didn't understand, uh, so I uh, drove on, as it were. But uh, it's good to talk to you again. Have a fun day. I'll uh, be getting some more video blogs out, because I know you're holding your breath for them. I'll bet you that's true, huh? www.micpeakperformance.com